In this video, we're going to talk about the Flipper Zero and SSTV. So, to understand our topic today, we're going to divide this video into three steps. In the first one, we'll see what is the SSTV and the main takeaway about that. On the second step, we'll see more about the experiment, what we are going to achieve, okay? And in the third one, last but not least, it will be time for a demo. And if you like new content, please subscribe and like videos. It really helped me to get my content promoted into the jungle. Thank you. First, SSTV means slow scan television. It is a method of transmitting still image over radio wave. It was originally developed for the use in the early days of television. So it was back in the days when live video transmission was not yet practical. So second point, how does it work? SSTV works by scanning an image line by line and converting it into an audio signal. So this is what I'm going to do now. I'm going to use a script and transform a picture into a wave audio file. And the Flipper Zero is going to play it. The audio signal is then transmitted over the radio and received by another SSTV device, which converts the audio back into an image. So we're going to see that later. And third point, by whom it is being utilized now. So SSTV has become popular among radio amateur operator and enthusiast because it's allow us to exchange image over long distances. Also interesting to know for some space station they were emitting and transmitting picture like that so who knows maybe you are going to have a new hobby now and catch every sstv signal but for that the flippers you won't be enough and you will need a sdl device but that's for another story here is the flow i used to transform and transmit a picture into wave so it is like encoded for sstv transmission then once i have like generated the wave audio file with the script i have transferred this file using q flipper and plugged it to my flipper zero then i played this wave with the flipper zero and the other device is listening with its microphone and thanks to a software and a bit of magic it's going to display the picture so let's see this in the demo so here's the setup i'm going to use an android device to decode the SSTV signal. So what is interesting here, I have like a standalone uh, Android tablet, which is pretty old, but with this application, Robot36, and the built-in microphone, it will listen to the wave played by the Flipper Zero. So let's run Robot36. So, okay, now it's already decoding some, yeah, me just talking, okay? Now I'm going to select the mode I have used. So I have used Martin modes and the one. The reason is it's pretty simple. I didn't want to send like a huge wave file to the Flipper Zero and the resolution here is pretty, pretty small. So let's try this out. So from the Flipper Zero, I will use the music application Wave Player. And from here, 
I will run my file that I previ uh, previously generated. Okay. So watch out for you here. I will stop the noise at one point because for the video, I think it's really annoying.